Hi, in this video tutorial I will show you how to create an output of your codebook. Uh, there are two ways. First, in Excel. You click on the Code Manager icon. Then you, well, you have options here. You have an option of uh, creating an output for all codes of the project or by uh, specific uh, uh, co uh, code groups. So let's do this for all codes of the project. You click on this output icon. That will take you to Excel. And now you have this list of codes with associated information in an Excel spreadsheet. So you have the color of the code, the name of it, the groundedness, which means the number of quotations linked to it, the density, which means the number of codes linked to each one of these codes, the number of groups uh, in which or to which the code belongs, the comment, which is the operational definition of the code, the name of the person who created it, dates, and the person who modified that. So this is a, a, a simple spreadsheet. So what I would do here is I would I would select whatever you want to select and maybe copy and paste and take this into a Word document if you want. So that's what I would do. And now this is pasted in a Word document. So here we have our table with the uh, definition of each one of my codes. And of course, you can delete whatever columns you do not uh, need. The other option is to go to Code, Output, Codebook. And this is an output that will be uh, produced that can be copied and pasted into a Word document. So you go to uh, select all, copy, and then you take it to a Word document. Once pasted into a Word processor, you can edit it however you want. You may delete this, you may change the way you want the table to look, you may want to delete uh, columns and so on. The difference between this, uh, this uh, output and the other one I show you is that this one will only give you the name of the code, the color, and the comment, which is the operational definition of the code. Uh, but the other one will give you more information. Thank you.